Welcome to Poggle and Mook's Big Day Out. Uh, we started with surprise alpacas, so couldn't go walkies just there, but uh, wham! There goes Mook charging into Poggle as always. Just no no cares in the world who he runs into, what he does. Yep, that's, that's classic Mook. So we went through uh, Cessnock and then right down through the mountains. Uh, mountains is probably a little bit generous. But they were windy roads. A terrible, terrible windy roads. Oh, watch out, Poggle. Yeah. Really doesn't notice that coming. So <laughs> there he is. Hey, Poggle. Hello. Yeah. <laughs> Little grey muzzle. He's smart enough to be able to step out of the leash, which is nice. Mook, on the other hand, would rather just try and tear the leash in half. We did find on our travels two tiny ponies. They were so small they look like little black dots, but there they are! Well, <laughs> you just have to trust me, I suppose. <laughs> hey, Mook, shake! Ew! Yeah, better there than somewhere else. Come on, step out of your leash, you silly dog. Alright, I'll just give up. He can just <laughs> walk sideways. <laughs> There you go, there's your little home. Fastest kennel. Now, I'm holding some treats. Poggle nose. Here you go. <laughs> there are ribs. There we go. Poggle delicate. Mook, you can't have it in the car. But if you come out here, there you go. Off. <laughs> oh, gone. It was about 36 degrees, so we had to keep... Every time we stopped, it was out with a bucket of water and let them have a drink. There's a 10-gallon drum of water in the back of the car just for this trip. Little did I know, but in Wiseman's Ferry, there is an actual fact, a car ferry. It holds about 11 cars, and this is it. Uh, goes across this muddy bit of river. I, maybe they couldn't afford a bridge, I don't know, but uh, it drags itself on a cable. It doesn't have a, a motor if it's, well, I suppose it's got an electric motor to, to pull itself along the cable. Hello, Mook. <laughs> Look, spotted a poggle. And that was our day out. <laughs>